We've all known the name Kinnick. Kinnick statue, Kinnick stadium, Kinnick speech. What Niall Kinnick hasn't been is a real flesh and blood man. Kinnick the documentary changes that. We see Niall as an undersized kid in Adele with natural talent and great depression work ethic. We learn through the remarkable storytelling of Niall's first cousin that Niall practiced and ran drills constantly. Don Bice grew up with Niall. Bice is now in his mid 90s and he's sharp, spry and charismatic. What a revelation Bice is. He brings Niall's childhood, family and hometown to life. When Bice tears up, you might too. Kinnick would become a multi-sport all-state star in Iowa and for his senior year, Nebraska. He wanted to go to college at the University of Minnesota, a power at the time, but there was no interest. 5'8", 165 was small, even in the 1930s. Kinnick would come to love the University of Iowa as a second home, and his epic senior season plays out with film, photos, and historical perspective. By the end, you appreciate the one-loss Ironmen and their do-everything star, not just Iowa star, but national star. Kinnick won 1939 AP Athlete of the Year. Joe DiMaggio batted 381 and finished second. Joe Lewis won four fights by knockout and finished third. The film then fully shows the power and context of Kinnick's legendary Heisman Trophy speech. At 22, he thinks and sounds 42. It's even better than we thought. Kinnick's star rose even more, and though Niall had pro offers, he went to law school at Iowa, then volunteered for the Navy. It's during this time the film, via Niall's journals, really enlightens us. Niall had much on his mind, social issues, politics, and dating. By turns, he's restless and contemplative. In 1943, Kinnick's plane goes down off the coast of Venezuela. He's gone and just 24 years old. Many think this grandson of an Iowa governor could have been president of the United States. We'll never know. But what we do know, thanks to cousin Don Bice, historian Mike Chapman, Goldfinch filmmakers, and others, is Niall Kinnick earned the accolades. Kinnick had feet of clay, but he lived an extraordinary life, albeit a short one. I know him more. I think more of him. I think he will too.